Hello everyone, my name is Josh, you can call me Claw, and I'm coming back with a new series I made, because, you know, I'm making series now, which will sometimes replace Road to 15 Stars, uh, and will completely replace it when I complete that series. Oh, who just got a line? And nobody. I don't know what, what makes that activate, if you know, if it's like a buddy changing places, I don't know, because I thought, I thought that, like, it flickers when a new buddy got a line, I don't know. Um, so I will be playing through Pillbugs, because Pillbugs, um... They have the normal set of levels. They have five different areas with uh, six levels each. And when you completely complete a level, you get a little, like, gold pill bug. And I'm gonna be doing that. Along with showing off my den. <laughs> um, a very confusing thing with den, I usually just throw stuff together and eventually starts to come out well, like this section. Oh my gosh, I love this. Um, they started selling carnations in Treetops Gardens. Also got a traffic cone, one of my dream items. I don't know where it came from. It came from the adventures. I don't know why it's there. And um, I don't know if I mentioned this on the last video, but it won't show up now. Sometimes when you change those buttons, they move. The actual lamps move. Uh, kind of glitchy. Yep. And um, in regards to the ornaments, actually all ornaments have a larger hitbox down below it. I don't know why. Uh, and then something odd happened with... The giant ornaments, so that's a giant Jinko Bell, which you win in the, uh, adventure, or in the maze. Uh, when I won this, or when I got at the beginning of the day, it appeared as red, but when I got into my den, it was green stuff. I also asked someone else, and they said that when they got it in the beginning of the day, or whenever they logged on, it was red, but then it turned green, so... That's a bit glitchy. I don't know. Um, then I have an area over here, have the hedges, and then this, which is cool. Someone tried to me a lightning cloud for one of the adventure items, and I was happy to oblige, because I don't like spending diamonds. I don't know what I'm saving them up for. Oh, and I got one of these. I do not know where you get them. If you know where you get the sand castle things, please tell me. Okay, so I've, I've really been improving my den. It's coming out well. I don't know. I might do a full tour once I get everything done with it. So let's start this series. Um, see, I'm just going to be playing through all this. I don't know. Schedule, it's not going to be on... Fridays, that's for sure, but, uh, Pillbugs, if you didn't know, if you've never played this game, it's a possibility. It is Animal Jam, uh, reskinned version of the game Peggle. You know, basically, same function all the time. I have actually never played Peggle, and I was trying to figure out what it was a reskin of, and then my brother told me, I was like, oh, okay. And I saw some Peggle gameplay, I was like, oh, okay. Um, and I will be playing through this on hard mode, so, in the easy modes, they have a direction like line will see where you shoot to and what you do is you have to hit all the pill bugs and I'm first level is pretty easy and the way to get the gold is and I'm doing awful but it's it's not too hard on the first level mouse is a bit flickery it's a bit throwing me off um what you have to do to normally pass the levels I just plain unsafe right now just dang it Ah, uh, but what you have to do to pass the levels is get all the blue ones. Ah, I might actually fail. It's really distracting, I don't know. Oh, frames are fine though, it says. There we go. But the key when trying to go for the gold is to not get all the blue ones, because then uh, once you get all the blue... Oh no. Oh no, dang it. See, I didn't get the gold star. So... I've actually completed all, all the levels on gold before. I'm just going to call them gold, I don't know. And you get an achievement called Going for the Gold. Uh, I have that, you can go check it, I don't know. <laughs> um, but then I was like, you know what, I might play that through for the thing, you know? It, it looks it's cool. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm just going to be playing through. It's going to be like Road to 15 Stars. Not much happening. Uh, not as boring though, because it's very boring. Uh, so yeah, what you're doing in normal gameplay is to get all the blue pill bugs, and then you'll complete the level, but in the gold we have to collect all the pill bugs. I don't touch- gosh dang it! See that one, I didn't get blue because I didn't get to take out those two last pink ones. I'm actually struggling, struggling a lot with the first level. Um, when it gets a lot harder, basically just go through the very last level. is isn't actually as hard as some of the other ones. Um, and it's definitely a lot harder when you don't have the direct comparison of where your mouse is going. Yeah. This game can be naturally found 
in the forest, whatever you pronounce it as, I don't know. I've heard multiple pronouncings, I've heard multiple pronouncings of all the places in Animal Jam. Because, <laughs> you know, they're all fancy names, and African, and I don't know. Some of them are. I know that, um, all the server names are something to do with wild stuff. I recognize uh, the name Tigris. Tigris is a river over in whatever that area. Is that the Middle East? I don't know if it's technically in the Middle East. Uh, it's in that area. <laughs> um, but it's like a really old river, Tigris. Because I recognize that. I don't remember if I recognize anything else. Uh, but there, there are lists. You can go look it up. I might read one once, just so I can, you know, knowledge and stuff. Because I have a lot of that of this game. Um, you see, I got the gold for that level. Because uh, I got all the stuff. Um, and, uh, so we're going on second level. Second level... So level formats usually have ones which are just completely open, ones that have two of these leaves, which are just just land surfaces on either side. Um <clears throat> and then they have ones that have a leaf like that. It's like a triangle kind of thing. These episodes will probably probably also run for about ten minutes. I don't know. I'm gonna cancel off and then go watch the footage to make sure it doesn't look awful like it's running on a potato, which is basically how my computer runs um i know i always talk about computers and stuff and how i don't have a good one uh and i do know what computer i will get whenever i save up 300 dollars. well whenever i save up 200 dollars uh the parents will probably pair well whoop, whatever they got gold for that going on the third level like i said there's six uh levels in each section and there's five sections uh, the fifth one being the hardest um <laughs> But yeah, my dad talked to me about computers and stuff, because mostly just most of the time I just complain and say, ah, I want a better computer, and then it's like, okay, so what kind of computer are you looking at? Uh, and we're getting, a, or the future computer would be a Lenovo, I'm pretty sure, how you say it, I don't know, because I didn't see it spelled out. Um, it's pretty good, it has better, <laughs> basically I think, I think an actual potato is probably better than this computer. Yeah, probably. Uh, but that is the future computer it costs around three hundred dollars. So see, I struggle with this level because I'm talking, I'm distracted. I don't know how long this playthrough will run. Levels at ten minutes a piece. It really depends on how focused I am. <laughs> Today wasn't very focused. It's a bit late. I had a bit stressful day. Um, one of my favorite games, which actually does run on this computer, not terribly. Uh, nope, I failed. Uh, just have to play again. Uh, Terraria. It's had a glitch, which this didn't happen before, but when I start up the game, it just freezes the whole computer. If I don't, like, the mouse will stop moving, and then, um, on my keyboard, I can also tell. It's not like just the game lags out the computer, it's on my keyboard when I press the caps key, and, um, or caps lock, and then also scroll lock, and one other lock, I forgot, a num lock. They light up a little, uh, Light, light, light up a light at the keyboard, and what is completely frozen, fro I want to say like freezes and frozen, whatever. When it's that on Terraria, it, the light doesn't even light up. That means that the keyboard's completely frozen as well. That means the entire computer doesn't have to restart. And today that happened four times in a row, and then the fifth time I start up the computer, and it had to do a thing. I don't know why. A couple times it does this where it has to like check the CD. I don't even know what it does, but it takes about five hours. That's a bit of an over exaggeration, but it takes a really long time and it's really annoying and I can't do anything to it to mess with it, whatever. Um, it says like press a key to cancel this, but the keys don't work most of the time, so I don't even know. It's not like the computer's updating because most of the time it won't update because it's too old. Uh, awful. Um, something else I forgot to mention about this game, the way the gems work. I don't believe this is on Double Gems anymore, I don't know. It was on Double Gems, it was really good. If it's on Double Gems, it's amazing for coins. If you just play this for a while, I find this game actually pretty relaxing. Um, but what level is this? Oh, okay, so we, we completed the first, the first three levels. So we got the next three, these, these these, and these. Um, but I find this game very relaxing, so if I sit back 
to just play this game for a while, I can get lots of gems. See, it doesn't, isn't, it doesn't run double gems anymore. I said like five times. Um, I guess that wraps up the first episode. I guess. I mean, I talked about some stuff. I know I didn't talk about everything I want to talk about, but hey, you can only talk about so many things in ten minutes. It was really like eight minutes because the first two minutes were talking about my den. I don't know when this series is actually going to happen. I was going to do a video on Thursday. I said I was going to rant about HHQ and how terrible they are at the job, like I've mentioned multiple times before. But I didn't. Maybe I'll make a video tomorrow. I don't really know. <laughs> I guess that's all for now. Uh, goodbye, my Kalanian subjects. And leave a comment on hype for a new series and this might just pop up whenever now i don't know i try to have a schedule it's it's hard also with christmas break and you know me being a procrastinator anyways <laughs> goodbye everyone goodbye my kalanian subjects i was doing like a christopher walken voice never mind goodbye my kalanian subjects and until next time have a wonderful day